Oh, hello. Didn't see you there. Welcome. Welcome to today's stream. Today we are going to be playing Sid Meier's Pirates again. Last time... I don't even recall where we left off. But we left off somewhere. And that is where we will be continuing today. Sorry if I seem a bit out of it today. I woke up maybe two hours ago. So I really haven't done very much. Or if I also sound a bit differently. Same, same reason. <laughs> oh my. Alright, well. May as well get on with it then. How are you all doing today? You're all doing alright. Let's see. Ah, this must be where we are. Where we were. I don't even remember. <laughs> if I'm being honest. What was I doing? What is happening? <laughs> it has been so long. Oh, we must have been wanting to divide the plunder, likely. I I assume. It it's been Oh, it's been too long. Literally, it it's been too long. I literally don't remember. <laughs> anything of what I was doing. So, oh my, I have an 11,000 gold reward from the English. Whoops. <laughs> I don't think I necessarily meant to do that. Oh, well, we can find this treasure. Should we do that? Or should we divide the plunder first? And then we can do that. You know, I don't know that any of the, the men with us currently are um are worthwhile enough for for us to um take with us to get that treasure. I think we may just leave them out. <sighs> mm. See, we do actually have a good amount of hate from the English. So we may may just sack some more of their cities just very quickly I think that's where we may have left off might also make our crew a little bit happier with us just a little bit not, not entirely happier but you know we have 300 and some of them so may as well do, do something before we lose nearly all of them Oh, it's Blackbeard. Hello there, Blackbeard. They are poor, but they have lots of soldiers. You're bound for Havana. But you're going the wrong way, mates. It, like, very, very much so, actually. You're, you're going very much in the wrong direction. Look, okay, there you go. There you are. How are you all doing today? I'm actually... As I said, I'm a bit out of it again today. More my own fault again. I, I got up rather later than I, I tend to. So... Oh, suddenly they have a hundred soldiers. Well, alright then. I must say, this is probably my least favourite part of this entire game. Is this battle minigame? Quite frankly, it's... Number one, it's a bit dull. And number two, you can lose, even though you have, like, the majority, the vast majority of, of people, you can still lose, which, I'll be entirely honest, I don't understand how that can be, personally. I don't understand it, but I'm not sure that I'm meant to. Oh, I didn't realize it was, it was you that I was controlling. Okay, uh, skip you, actually. Yes. Well, seeing as how they can only really attack us 
directly. We'll send some men out around the sides and things. But they're most likely going to try and, yeah, attack us just from the front here. So if we can angle our musketmen. No, you, you can't see them from there. All right. If you say so. I don't care about you. We may have chosen the worst area to have started. And if so, we, we may lose this. Not great. That's that's not not fantastic, if I'm being honest. You know, we're just gonna wait for you. Because we might be able to attack them. They may be close enough that we can try and kill them. It's possible. Yes, you, you just stand there. Really? Even still? Oh my word. Right. Well, we'll try and position you a little bit better then. I suppose. Don't care about you. Actually, you go ahead and just hang out there, I guess. Um, sure. Shoot them. <sighs> no one died? Truly? Come on. There you go. Oh, wow, well, you got a bunch of them. Good work. Good work, gentlemen. One thing I do like is that when you lose men, you actually do less damage, it seems, which, you know, that makes sense. Like, you wouldn't, they, they wouldn't be able to kill nearly as many people with fewer gunmen. That, that honestly makes a lot of sense to me. I, I actually appreciate that, that little mechanic there. You can just not move. Go ahead and move forward a little bit. Sure, kill them. That'll work. Oh look, you actually did damage to them this time. Good job. Maybe you can kill them outright. That'd be great. No! Okay, well, that's... That's also fine. It's not like I was expecting you to actually kill them. Look at that. 2%. Did almost nothing to us. Fantastic. It's fantastic. By the way, can you can you hear any of the stuff that's happening? Because I, I can't tell if you can hear it or not. I I can't see my sound settings. This this game is the exact same reason that basically I um I just started right into it. Because Otherwise, this this game does not seem to like me or anything at all, ever. Hold on. You're also 40. We'll move you, you men over there. Okay. If you're also 40, then... Let's see if we can't go over here. Let's let's get them a little bit less. I feel that's more important than getting rid of the two percent right there. Oh my god, they still didn't do nearly anything to them. My word. See, because two percent divided by two is nothing. Uh, we may need to kill you. 8% is actually... That, that can be rather damning, if I'm being honest. Um, so technically, we could end this right here. 
we could just get to that gate. We could move these folks over to the gate and we'll win. But I don't know if that'll actually let us take over the town, which is part of what we're wanting to do there. Because we want it to be French. Because we want the French to like us. We don't just want to piss off the English. So, instead, well, yeah, we're, we're going to try and just kill as many of the of the soldiers as we can, quite frankly. Because hopefully that'll equate to... Well, quite frankly, we'll, we'll be able to actually take over the town, as, as I was saying. And since they're really not doing very much damage to us at this point, I feel like we're fine to go a couple more rounds. Even though that's technically us right there, we don't really need to worry about us dying here. It's, it's fine. We're fine. Like, even if we end up running away, which is sort of the default defeat thing, is you, you end up, like, running away, the, the one person. Like, it seems like you cannot, literally cannot, just outright kill all of the people in any unit. Like, they... There's always at least one guy who runs away like that. Brave man, just standing alone. Oh, come on, mate. Don't even try it. Thank you. Oh, not bad. Yes, I think we will install a French nobleman. Do you have anything to sell us? Ooh, NATO. Guns. We like guns. Guns are nice. I really don't remember who we've been romancing and who we've not. Rock Brasiliano. He's literally just the worst, isn't he? He's he's the worst pirate. He's currently ranked seventh, but is that because I've killed other people? Hold on. Oh no, sorry, it's Jack Rackham, who's just the worst. Rock isn't that bad. Barty boy over here. Not not a big fan of his either, but you know. So, one thing they will always have over me is these ships captured. I don't know how they capture all of these ships. Like, it, I, I literally do not understand it. But I will always have more towns ransacked because I do that a lot, honestly. <laughs> that, that happens a lot. Oh, and the uh, unique items. <laughs> Look at all that. That's, that's quite, a, quite a turnaround there. But look at how much gold he has. Other, uh, we could have taken down Blackbeard. We could have taken him and gotten his gold and everything, but Blackbeard hasn't done anything to us. Why, why would we do that? That would just be rude. Oh, I cannot wait until we have enough love from our governors and people to get just free repairs and upgrades and everything. Do we have free repairs yet? See, I don't remember. It's been... Oh, no, thank you. <laughs> Sorry. I know I'm going through a lot of the dialogue, like, really fast and everything. I've I've seen all of this so many times. It, it just repeats, and I'm so sorry. I'm not going to read all of it every single time. All right, I think we're, I think we're pretty much done here. Should we take over any other cities while we're just sort of in the area? I don't think Grand Bahamas had much of a much of an army.
Arrived in Nassau. Ah. Well, now they have a bunch. Oh, I was pressing the wrong button. I was pressing the zoom in button, which is why it was zooming in. Hello again, Blackbeard. Don't worry, I'm, I'm not... Oh my gosh, are you attacking me? What the f***, man? What is wrong with you? Dear God, what, seriously. This is rude. No, don't raid them right now. Oh, and, and they were wealthy and everything. Oh, shucks. 40 soldiers. Okay, so I don't know when this starts to happen. Like, if they have to be under 100 or, or when. But yeah, when they just don't have enough defenses, instead they'll just send out the, uh, the captain of the guard, it seems. And you'll fight them. And of course, we are a young, beautiful stallion of pirating. How, how, how did that help us? <laughs> I don't know. French again. Yes. All right. Very good. Oh, I'm getting an up... Uh, uh, merchants will trade many more goods. Oh, yay. 50 acres. 50 acres. That's that's nothing. That's, that's nothing. <laughs> All right, well... Oh, Nassau has 280. We have 280. Actually, we could technically... Can we get a few more men? Oh, yes, actually. Okay, I meant a few more than that, but... You know, that's, that's also fine. Ah! Oh, yes, no, they, they are apparently very... Very unhappy with me at the moment. Well, if we want to avoid any more mutinies... Oh, crap. Come, come over here. <laughs> we may just want to... Wait, is that Blackbeard or... Oi! You son of a... Who asked you? Oi? Oi? Talk to Black... Blackbeard isn't here! What are you talking about? What? I... I am Blackbeard, the second ranked pirate in the Caribbean, and you are not. Now go away, you little pile of dog poop, or I'll give ye the black spot. Yeah, whatever. Sure, I'll take it. I'm not going to attack a French ship. I'm with the French, you fool. Alright, well, very likely they're going to mutiny again, so we'll just... Yeah, we'll just get, get rid of it. We're going to continue as an adventurer captain. I feel like adventurer captain's a good mix between the two. They captured Grand Bahama? Was Grand Bahama not French for a minute? What happened? What's going on? What, 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 uh... Yeah, we'll, we'll come aboard, mate. Anyway. I'm, I'm aware. I've literally talked to him. Okay, there's a few things that we should start doing. One is 
tracking down our sister, Puerto Cabello, which is over here. No, it's up here. No, where the f is this? Where is Puerto Cabello? There it is. All right, it's all the way down here. Oh my word! Screw you. <laughs> Sheesh. Uh, oh, and we should also get Leolane. I, I don't know how to say this man's name. Leolane's treasure. San Juan. Where is San Juan? San Juan is here. Oh, we have a heart in Santo Domingo. Though the governor's daughter is rather plain there. Is it Leogan? Governor's daughter is beautiful in Leogan. So, yes, maybe. We shall see. It's 120 now, but we don't have that many men. We only have 75, and we can only really hold 75, if I recall correctly. You know, let's get some free ships by transporting a governor. Or whatever this is. Draw, yes. sure, tell me more about Caracas. Shut the gun. I don't care. I'm not fighting Blackbeard, lady. Alright? Calm yourself. Hmm. No. Well, we might... We might want food from the merchant. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Alright, Mr. Mayor. Oh, good. Fun thing, if you can confuse the um, the navigation stuff for the new mayor enough, then they will just sort of zoom around like that. You saw how he was doing just like big old circles and all. Uh, yeah, he'll they'll just do that a bunch, and each circle will get wider and wider until literally they just reach the destination immediately which which is in my opinion hilarious and and great honestly like like you think i want to spend all this time transporting you like if you can just show up there that that'd be awesome but this time i did want these ships we'll have two guns baby oh Pressing the wrong buttons again. Oh my gosh. Press the zero instead of two. <laughs> my hand seems a bit off today. It's a twer. I think I've said this before. This is like the best pirate game that I've I've ever played. It really makes you feel like you're actually a cool badass pirate. Whereas a lot of pirate games are just like, yeah, you you sail the seas and you do all that stuff, but you really gotta fight for your share. Like, no, this one you just you're cool. You're doing cool shit all the time, man. You you're fighting off evil captains or you're plundering towns or you're, you're ro romancing beautiful daughters or like it, it's all just it's all great oh nice that's actually going to be great for us yes welcome aboard lads all right now that we have two extra ships we can actually get we can start getting a miniature army for attacking Nassau. A 
prosperous French village. Yeah, it's twelve more board weights. I will have two gold pieces to my name if I do this. Kind of still want to do it. I feel like we'll have opportunities to get them later. I, I don't know that my crew would not mutiny. You know? I, I honestly can't be sure that they will not mutiny on me if I... If I were to do that. Ooh, we can sell some guns. We don't need all these guns. And because of that, we could sell a ship. Should we? Yes, we should. Because there's apparently a... Okay, there's a ship over there. Why it's all the way over there, I, I do not know. Ooh, an English smuggler. Are you at war with the English right now? You are! Very good. Sorry, Mr. Smuggler. But you're at war with the country that I'm currently allied with, so... We shall be taking you quickly here. Yeah. I do love that the time of day can sometimes change. Like, if you're fighting for a while in boat combat and then you go to the you know duel and all that you can it, it will actually change the time of day nice some lots of luxuries there that's what you like to see from a from a smuggler oh yeah we were going to attack Nassau Completely forgot about that. Oh, that's what happens with an ADD brain. Spanish smuggler. Are you also at war with the French? No, you're not. Wow, apparently the Dutch and the English are just dicks right now. <laughs> they are at war with everyone. Man, you knocked off one of my freaking guns. You right bastards. Oh, you dicks. We'd already crashed into each other when you fired. There we go. There we go. Ooh, some lots of spice this time. Very good, very good. Do we still have a... 2,000 gold for the English, but nothing for the Spanish? Well, that's nice, actually. We might be able to get a promotion with the Spanish. And some crew. Right up in St. Augustine. If, of course, we didn't attack this, which... Of course, we are going to. It is a treasure. Or a trade galleon, so, you know. How could we... Oh my god, I drove right into those, didn't I? Yo ho. Say hearties, yo ho. Oh, when we're at sea, I do want to start singing a couple of piratey tunes and such. If you're not here for that, I understand. And you can uh, feel free to leave if, you, if you'd like. I, I don't... No, no hard feelings on that. An invasion force? To who? Who are you invading? Actually, no, really. Like, who are they invading? Well, it's either the Dutch or the English. 
So I'm guessing they want Grand Bahama. That's my guess. Oh, I didn't actually mean to attack you like that. I meant to drive away so that you can just, you know, invade Grand Bahama. I don't, I don't really care. Up until the point when you're at war with the French. At which point I will care and will take everything from you. See, I know a lot of sea shanties and things. I don't know how many I could sing. And quite frankly, I... I was gonna say, who is that guy fighting? Oh, sorry, got distracted. I did Ebright, I swear. Oh, there we go. Yeah, welcome aboard, lads. Alright, now do I have a... 3,000. But no thing from the, um, from the English. An interesting, interesting turn of events. Leave me alone. I was hoping to get a few more men from St. Augustine, but... Well, quite frankly, you, you had too much of an enticing... greatly enticing fleet of people. So how could I say no to attacking a treasure fleet and then an invasion force? Ooh, an English smuggler. Duke of Kent. You know, I don't fight the English very much to be able to see their, their captains like this. I don't... I, I haven't seen this captain in quite a long time. Goodbye, sir. Some more spice. Lovely. Love to see more spice. We don't need more guns or food. Alright, and now we're going to attack the Grand Bahamas again because again the English are at war with basically everyone so basically everyone will appreciate me for attacking the Grand Bahamas oh they don't hate me right now neat Leogan that's a ways away not too far away but it's a ways away so you might be wondering, well, crap, if I'm not, if it won't let me attack them from here, how am I going to attack Grand Bahamas? See, that's, that's the thing, is you still can, actually, if it'll let me. So you've got to weigh anchor, then literally walk to, wait, which way is the place? It's over here. Started going in the wrong direction. Hopefully they don't get too many troops in the while it's going to take me to get over here. Oh good. This'll be easy then. Very easy. Oh, maybe I should have looked for a promotion from the English before I... I sacked the city. Nice. Hello, Mr. Governor. Yay! Upgrades will be for free! Yes. No thank you. Goodbye. This is what we love to see. Because now, not only can we repair things, but look at this. So, if I upgrade this with Chain Shot, suddenly the selling price is more. Despite the fact... But I got it for free. It's fantastic. It's great. I love it. Alright, what's the smallest? You. So I'll sell you. 
Let's sell you as well. We still have 120 tons of space. Which is fine. Alright. Where else should we go? Sugar for two isn't bad. Spice for five isn't either. Or the luxuries. Selling cannons for three isn't too bad. And again, we don't need that many cannons. You boys want to join? Nice. Ooh, 3,000. Just to make Jesuit missionaries happy? I don't think so. I don't care. All right. Now we can return to our ship. Uh-oh. Military payroll. Heading for Nassau. Not on my watch. That'll increase their military. And we can't have that. Bastard. Easy. You might think we are at a disadvantage here, sir, but I assure you, we are not. Goodbye. You dick. How about you? Should I do my pirate accent for this stream? I wonder. There was a chat? Or was there not a chat? Suddenly it's starting to say new. I don't know why. Yes, welcome aboard, lads. Or 80 tons isn't, isn't too bad. How many troops are in Nassau? 100. So we should be able to take them. In theory, at least. Well, that ship just disappeared. Stay away from me, Blackbeard. You were kind of a dick to me earlier. I don't appreciate it. Well, you know, we got to do this again. Yeah, I think this might be the best location. You be someone else, thank you. Basically, we want to draw them out into the open. Then we should be able to take them. We can draw them out from the trees and such. Hey, look at them. We should be able to actually take them quite easily. Should be fine. Move you there. Oh, you can shoot them? Then fantastic, do so. Also shoot them. Oh, there's more behind them. Well, I'm glad we took the initiative then. Oh, even more in the trees. My word. Oi, don't you dare, you bastards. Fire. There we go, there we go. Not you quite yet. 
Sure, we'll move you over there. Out of the trees, into the open. Fire. I think this is a good spot for you. I'll take you out. At least for now. Making sure that you stay alive for the next part. <coughs> Sorry about that. Cough. Nothing serious, I promise. Hmm, I will move you there. Any more? I fire. No, it's not a lot. But it's a little, and a little can go a long way. You should stay there. You, take them. Hmm. We'll hold there. For now. Four. Four. Die. Shoot them. Make them fear us. Are they facing us now? Fire. Can you attack anyone else? Oh, apparently not. Hold. Fire on them. There we go. I cannot tell. Hold. Hold. Sorry. Drinking some water. Lifeblood. Or whatever sorts they call. Yes. Fire upon them. Attack. Blink. So oh, it's just to destroy their source of attack. Move into the trees there. Fire. Make them wish they'd never crossed us. Hold. Truly. You think that's that's wise? Ooh. 
Return fire. Once again. Not you. You. Sure you want to take a bit of revenge against the man who's been trying to kill you with the entire freaking turns. French nobleman. Very good. Good lot of men. Right. To Havana. Oh, really? You don't say. But I would. I don't think it's quite in the best of my. My best interest to get fully involved in such. It's beautiful being able to just get anything you want here. Lovely. Oh, of course, you're not going to have great prices for things after all you were just sacked. Four. Four for goods. That's not bad. Four for guns, too. That's also not bad. We'll buy a little bit more food. Not too much, just a little bit. Oi, Grand Bahamas. Blackbeard, what the hell's wrong with you? Corruption runs rampant in the sow. <laughs> Should hope so. Luxury sell for a ton here. Guns are cheap. Food not so much. You do anything for my ships. Seems as though not. Sporting troops? To where? Where might I ask? Are you? No, I'm not attacking the damn governor that I'm freaking transporting. Wouldn't that be quite the, the interesting tale to tell? Oh yes, the governor didn't arrive. Why? The governor that I was was bringing there, why didn't he arrive? Well, of course it's because I killed him. What other reason could you expect? Am I supposed to leave a ship unplundered? Unsullied by pirate hands. I think not. Oi, it's one of my cannons, you fop. Oh, just get to it. Oop. <laughs> That's the wrong one. There we go. Oi, my fleet is full. How's your merchandise? Aye, we'll, we'll take the lot. We will take the lot. Welcome aboard, mates. Abyss? Where in the hell is that? Oh, yes, I don't care. Alright. Very good. It's now prosperous means we should be able to sell these for a much better price now. Very good. 
Eh, maybe not the good so much. Spice, though. 12 gold for spice isn't great, but it's not bad. Got anything for me in terms of ships? Eh, we'll sell this one. Trade that and sell you as well. Very good, very good. Are you transporting troops as well? Sure hope so. Oh, immigrants. Oh, that's interesting. Eleuthera. Eleuthera. God, I don't know how to say any of these damn things' names. St. Augustine. 220 soldiers. I have 217 men. Oh, that's Blackbeard. I see, I see. And we may be able to recruit a few. You folk here. No, oh, thank you. 25. 25 is not bad. Only 2,000. I that works. Right. I'll be honest. I'm not going to lie to you, chat. Today may be a very short stream. I may not go much longer than an hour. I know that's incredibly short for some of you. I probably outrank you, sir. You'd better leave. Leave. Or I'll make you leave. Oh, come on. Very good. Thank you, my lady. Sixty-two. It's not bad. We've been there just a minute ago. There as well. Anything you can do for my ships? Can do something for that one. It's not too bad. Sugar for two gold. It's not bad neither. Blackbeard, calm yourself. Oi, don't attack me neither. Jeez, how far can his shot reach? Bloody hell. Shan't wait for you. Why, why, Spanish? Why must you tempt me so? A trade galleon. Whenever I want to enter your waters. Every time. Farewell. Apparently I don't have enough for them to take me seriously. Fifty-four. It was three thousand somewhere else. Yeah, so you can join my my crew. Fourteen for spice is not bad. That'll do. Sell an extra sugar for good measure. Okay, the treasure galleon's over this way. Nope, not going to attack you. I want to attack this. Oh, there. 
Ahoj. Aj. Go on. So, obviously, the the reason that I'm having a difficult bit of time today is partly my own fault, and I've spoken on this before. It's part of my reason why I got so confused with uh, the wizard game. Playing this off stream, just for fun. And apparently I must stop doing that as as I tend to get confused, it seems. Tends to linger in my brain a bit. Pressing the wrong button again. More men? Nine more men. No, oh, thank you. Need to reach there before the pirate attack. Nope. Anchor here. I'm the pirate that'll be attacking, thank you. There we are. Bloody hell. Well, at least they're out in the open. Some of them are, at least. Shit. Seriously, bloody hell. Look at all of them. Goddamn everywhere. Five squadrons. Plus, some horsemen that can move wherever the hell they want. You hold there. You go off. You need to shoot them. They need to take some damage. Otherwise, they will entirely obliterate my goddamn crew. It'll just run straight through us. Hold their officers. Let's see you die. I don't know if it's part of the computer AI. Or if it just is a happy circumstance. But they always seem to attack the plain pirates first. Like them. Instead of the buccaneers with the guns and, and the such. Which is interesting, okay? I shoot them. Please. Look at that. Much better. Very good. Very good. Oh, yes. I'm feeling good about this now. This strategy. Again, they seem to attack the pirates that are just sort of there before the, the buccaneers. Should they be in range? But if you can get them in cover as well, it also seems to be a priority of the AI to attack whoever's in cover. 
which of course helps me out, because that means always be in cover. It's just handy. It's just useful to know that they tend to lean in these directions, it seems. Of course, as soon as your crew starts to wane, as soon as they start to falter, you may find yourself in a predicament of, well, not being too much that can be done for you. As soon as those officers are gone, it's going to be up to just the buccaneers. The buccaneers are weaker than their buccaneers, their shooters. Their shooters are good in a scrap-ish. Not as good as pirates, but better than the buccaneers. Don't get me wrong. They're fine. But it's... Not near what they should be. And I think officers are also stronger than the regular pirates. Oh, fuck you. Kill. Kill them. Take revenge for your fallen comrades. I wait for you. Could end it right there. Could we? Or should we end it right here? If we can. They tend to stay. Oh, no, we did. It worked. The French. Of course. Yes. Oh, tell me about Barbados. Headed for Europe with a fortune. Wow. That's quite the ways away. Ooh. I don't know that almost any of my ships have this. No, none. Look at that. Char will sell you. Good. Got sugar for two. Sugar for two isn't good, but it's not terrible. Goods for five is is crap. Crap if we're trying to sell. I mean, sugar for two is crap if we're trying to sell. Don't get me wrong. Mm, no. Sorry. We already have a sweetheart. Pirate Raiders. You don't have my permission to ace this little town. Who exactly do you think you are? Pirate Raiders. Right? Who exactly do you think you are? No one. And I'll prove it to you. Go on. Thank you. Off. Off of my ship. Get off of my ship. That's what this is now. It's my ship. And now it's not my ship. Free of it. We shan't worry again. Crew is happy. Makes me happy. But 
we also do need to still work on getting my long lost sister as well as finding Leolani's treasure. Monsieur Bolognese, as I like to call him. I'm well aware that that's the home port of Blackbeard, and that that's the home port of Henry Morgan. Don't you worry, I am well aware. Look at us. We've taken over a good portion of of this whole Caribbean land here. You know what? Let's return to Leogan. We'll need to go by San Juan at some point and possibly even take it out before we get Le uh, Mr. Bolognese's treasure. New warship. Hey, oh. Trying to remember some she some sea shanties that I know. I wonder if I could play them. No, I'd get copyright struck. I'd get copyright struck easy. Twitch does it automatically. They don't mind. Motherfuckers. Did you even fight back? Nassau. People of Nassau. Who even... Where, where did they even come from? They had to have journeyed quite a ways. From St. Kitts, likely. Quite the ways away. Practically a world away. Yes, we only took out Captain Kidd. Why did we take out Captain Kidd? You don't remember. Oh? <laughs> You're giving me a goddamn uh, mark. Do you expect me to do your bidding? You damned fool. Oh, the redhead. My word. Oh. Red hair there. Oh, my. We may just allow you to keep this. Just so that I can see that red hair again. Oh, that set my heart a bit. God damn English. You're just a dick. Try. <laughs> oh. They left Nassau and returned to Nassau. You know what? We've been playing for a good hour now. As I said, we're a bit out of it today. Let's at least go to Leogan. See our, our sweet bunny there. See if we can't get a second heart from her. I honestly can't imagine that the Sow's going to stay in English hands for too long. 
What with them being at war with literally everyone. Yeah, see? The Dutch just took it. Possibly the French after them. Or the Spanish. Or the English again. Just to say. I know I care very little. The politics in this are unimportant in my personal opinion. Where are you transporting troops to? Santiago. They've already got enough troops. You don't mind me asking. What exactly is the point of having more troops in Santiago? Seems a bit excessive. In my opinion. They miss. Completely. Men, aim a little bit better. If you see that I'm a little bit off, aim with your own eyes. Like, things like that shouldn't happen. Come on, gents. Like that, again, should not be happening. You gents know how to look, correct? Fire. Oh, it's got no guns. No guns at all. It's no threat to me now. Could we play with her a bit? That would be fun. Oi! Don't crash into me! You bastards. I wanted to sink your damn ship. I didn't want to take it. I... But I suppose we shall. I... We may as well. Be able to repair it and upgrade it. Free, after all. Hey, and I'm born, and what do you do with a drunken sailor? What do you do with a drunken sailor? What do you do with a drunken sailor? I lie in the morning. I don't know the actual words to that song. That's not one of the sea shanties that I know. Truly, really, it's not. Oh, good. Port de Pie. Port de Pie. I hear Port de Pie is quite popular with the Zoomers. That's all I've heard. Sorry, I'm having to check and make sure that the steam pop-up that I just saw didn't show up on my on my stream. That would have been not great. Nine for sugar. Nine for sugar will get us a sale here. I'm willing to go at nine for sugar. Twenty-two for spice as well, and I think we'll hold on to our goods. I think I've seen it in the tens before, so we may as well hold on to it for now. Cotton sales for everyone. At the very least, it bumps up your trade in value. Thank you. For instance, for you, for another instance, 
Hello there, Mr. Governor. Only 50. Oh, hello there, sweetie. I'll be honest, I would wish to have given you a sparkling diamond necklace, but I don't have one. I do have a ruby ring. The city of Santa Marta. Where is that? Where is Santa Marta? There it is. Santa Marta. Low food prices. Interesting. So much Spanish over here. It's insane. It's insane. Look at all of this. It's all Spanish except for this one Dutch. One little Dutch. Tiny little Dutchman. How they made it there, I have no idea. We'll be taking them out, don't you worry. We'll try and limit the Spanish to a good three, maybe. Three places. May try to take over Barbados. Oh. Seems my assistant thought I was talking to it for a bit. Well, that is very clearly not the case. Well, anyway. That is where we're going to be ending today's little stream for you all. I hope you all enjoyed. I don't know why today was so off. But... Let's return to my actual accent. I don't know why I was so off today, but... Hopefully I will be getting back into these. I really do love this game. And... I think, again, I, I made the mistake of playing it off stream, which I played it a lot off stream, in fact. Uh, so much so, here, let's, you know, that's, that's an interesting idea. Let's actually show you all where I was at my last stream. I think it was here. So here we are. Let's not end in Trinidad. So in my last stream, I took over all of, not last stream. Last stream, I didn't do almost anything. So I started out in an earlier time, which means that there's actually less cities and things for people to, to have. I took over all of this southern coast here. Every single one of these were me. I installed all of these English areas. I installed all of these French ones, except for Coro. Coro, for some reason, I don't know why, it would not stay in anyone's hands for some reason. I would install the English, and then the French would take it over. I would install the French, and then the Dutch would take it over. I would install the Dutch, and then the Spanish would take it over again. And I didn't want any Spanish. Because the fun thing about this game, the, like, three major villains that you have to face multiple times will only spawn in Spanish towns, Spanish cities. But if they can spawn in any of them, then they can spawn anywhere in this southern area or going over here. Like, it is wild that literally you can, you can fight the bad guy here in Veracruz, right outside of Veracruz. 
not even a day out. So you then go, you, you beat him, kick his ass, go into Veracruz, talk to the bartender, and he's like, oh yeah, that guy, he's in Margarita now. Like, what? How the fuck did he get there? <laughs> did he invent the airplane when I wasn't looking? What the hell happened? Is he magic? <laughs> what is going on? There's, there wasn't even a a possible time frame here. Just yeah, we're just by by. All right. So yeah, no, that's that's basically I I did a lot. Um, last time I ended in Trinidad, but I wanted to kind of see if it will have a different ending if I end somewhere else. Where else do I want to possibly end? I used to have a girlfriend in Mar Maracaibo when that was French, but then the Dutch took it over and now I don't have a girlfriend there anymore. So, yeah. Yeah, that's, it just, it's not there anymore. You know what, let's go to Panama, if we can. If we can get to Panama. On the good ship Venus, by Christ you should have seen us. Figurehead was a whore in bed, sucking a dead man's. Captain's name was a lugger, and by Christ he was a bugger. He wasn't fit to shovel shit from one ship to another. Captain's wife was Mabel, and by God was she able to give the crew their daily screw upon the galley table. The captain's daughter Charlotte was born and bred a harlot. Her thighs at night were lily white, by morning they were scarlet. L literally one of my favorite songs of all time. <laughs> the good ship Venus. From what I can understand, the entire purpose of the song, The Good Ship Venus, is literally just every single verse make it worse than the last one. <laughs> There's a point where they uh, they have a dog, and I'm not going to describe it because I don't know if that's against TOS. <laughs> oh, you can see my money here. Yeah, that I got from beating the Marquis del Montalban and from killing all the other pirates and stealing all of their money. That I also did. I got my, some of my family back. Found a lost city, half of another. Found most of the treasures and everything. Pretty well decorated. 19,000 gold reward from the Spanish, because I, I really bullied them. At one point I had a 66,000. Where exactly are you going? Are you going to Puerto Cabello? Yes, you are. It's fine. I'm not going to get in your way. You continue on. I have no qualms with the French at the moment. Alright, we're heading to Panama. Still a little bit farther. Let's see, what other... Oh, beep bump, there's a bully in the alleyway. Bully in the alley, help me, Bob. There's a bully in the alley, bully down at him, Bona. I suddenly got down in dirty last night. Way, hey, bully in the alley, Sally is the gal I got smart. Bully down at him, Bona. Help me, Bob. There's a bully in the alley, way, hey, bully in the alley, help me, Bob. There's a bully in the alley. All right, what else? What else do we know? What are other piratey songs? I don't know the Wellerman that well. I know, like, the, the basic one. There once. There once was a man who set to sea, and the name of the ship was the Billy S. T. Her bowed it. Her sails took wind, her bowed it down, I'll blow my belly boy blow. 
Soon may the Willowmen come to give us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue is done, we'll take our tea and go. Sort of know that bit, but like nothing else about it. Nothing else of that song. Right, we're going to weigh anchor here. The hopes that we'll be able to find Panama City. Not Panama City, but Panama. I think that's it over there. Yeah. Just head straight on. And then we'll get to see what my score is for this one. See, again, I have a, a sweetheart in Trinidad. But I'm wondering if I end in a different city, will she join me there or... I'll just, just enter the town. I don't need to attack them. So if we divide the plunder, 57,000 gold pieces. They take a small fortune of 3,000 gold pieces. That's not a small fortune. That's a fortune fortune. All right. Sounds good. Then we retire from pirating. Yes, it is time. Oh good, I did actually still end the correct one. Alright, you retire at the age of 44 in failing health. I, I was in failing health. You take up residence in the city of Panama with the profession of governor. You are joined by your wife, the beautiful daughter of the governor of Trinidad. See, that that's the thing that made it sort of awkward in the other one. Was that... If you if you stop in Trinidad, but you're marrying the daughter of Trinidad's governor, but you're the governor, it just seems a bit strange. Like you're marrying your own daughter, even though that's not what's happening, because it's, it's not. It's not. I promise you. Your title, the English Duke, makes you an influential citizen. Your accumulated wealth of 173,000 gold pieces and 35,000 acres of land provide you an extravagant lifestyle in a mansion near the town center. I figure I may just own the entire town with 35,000 acres, vanquishing the evil Marquis de la Montalban remains the highlight of your career. You are able to rescue three of your missing family members. Joy is tempered with sadness as you live out your remaining years. Longing for that one member that you missed. Your bold exploits make you the first most notorious pirate on the entire Spanish main. The legend of your dazzling victories and incredible adventures grows with every passing year. So I started out in 1620. Instead of 1660, like the games that I started with all of you. And again, there's less towns in this one. So it's actually a bit, quite a bit different. But yes, that's all the stuff that I did off stream. I did all of that stuff off stream. And so, I'll be honest, I'm sort of just, I don't know. I feel like I did it. I played the game, I won and I did it. So, basically... That's the that's the problem, is even though I technically like I, I I technically have beaten this game. But I still want to continue it on stream because it's it is still just a fun game. I don't think I'll do it every week. I might play this again at some point, but quite frankly, I don't know that I'll I'll play it even even just next week. I don't I don't know that I will. Who knows? Oh, tired for some reason. Oh, well, I, well, I know I I know I'm tired. 
Because I've, I've been oversleeping, basically. And today I, I definitely overslept. But, yeah, no, that's, that's actually where we're going to end it today. An hour and a half of stream. Not great, but also not, not the worst. Not, not a terrible stream length. I mean, no, it's it's pretty bad. And especially with literally Yeah. No, it's it's pretty bad. Um sorry if this was a bit of a disappointing stream for all of you. I again I, I sort of shot myself in the foot with this one. Where I wanted to play it so much that I played it off stream and then didn't want to play it on stream anymore. Which sucks. That, that sucks. I, I hate having done that. But this is where I'm going to end stream today. Honestly, I probably, even if I wasn't playing something else, or even if I was playing something else, if, even if I wasn't playing this, sorry, then I probably wouldn't have gone very long anyway. Again, I'm, I'm feeling tired, lethargic. I just, I really need to fix my sleep schedule, quite frankly. So, if you've watched, thank you for being here. If you're watching the VOD, thank you for watching all the way. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Enjoy yourselves. Make sure that you do the things that you need to do for yourself. And make sure you're, you're doing alright. And I'm not even going to plug myself because I, I, I really am that tired. I just want to... And, and, and well, I don't have work for the rest of the day I am still just exhausted and I'll need to rest up for work on Monday anyway with all that said thank you for watching you all take care of yourselves bye